my battery died and I had to had to charge it up. And in the meantime, I put the the uh, spring in there, the flat spring. Uh, put the linkage in this and and set it in there. I put the uh, plastic bushing on, put the strap on, and then put the uh, circle up on. So we're there. Now I measured the uh, the thickness here on the brake. I mean, it looks nice and thick, but I got uh, like 1.2 millimeters uh, on average all the way around, so it's like brand new almost. If I remember correctly, I remember thinking the guy didn't use it or he had, re he had replaced it recently. never know I'm more comfortable using my brake some four millimeter <clears throat> screws you know when I ordered that when I got that um, how high output oiler for the 250 my brain wasn't known because I should order two of them Put one on this saw. But really I should keep I should buy an OEM so that this is stays pure. I don't want to sully it. I don't know about in your part of the country, but this is towards the end of April, and I haven't seen very much sunshine this month. There's a guy that's got some big wood. I wanted to go cut some slabs, and my... Oh seven O's got a decomp problem. All right. So what do you say we get
I don't believe they put a washer on these. I wonder if there's enough room. I might have a washer. No, can't do that. I'm going to go look at the IPL. Yes, it does use a cover washer. No. Somehow, I don't have it. I might have put it on the 250 and it not come with the 250. Those were 660. And I looked the part numbers up and they're, they're not the same. So I don't want to try a washer that doesn't go on it. So just for this, we'll just, there's a washer that's supposed to go there. And I will, I will get the washer. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to take I'm going to take this apart. The uh, recoil um, goes over here anyway, so so I'll just debug this whenever I get the other parts, and I I want this together immediately. So I'll be back as soon as I do that. Okay, we got that done. Didn't take but a second. This side up with the cut, kind of like a saucer. I'll put a little bit more on there.
looks good Okay, we've completed this side, PTO side, clutch, brake, etc. And we'll be moving on to the other side of the saw. There we'll have a higher level of excitement to look forward to. That's what happens when you work on used saws, excitement. <laughs> 